Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So it's here. It's here guys. Bad Badge final season, season three is upon us. And I'm not ready, honestly. Um, I don't know how this season's gonna go, but it makes me really nervous um, because it could literally go any direction. Um, but obviously we know very few of the clones show up in Rebels. So I'm a bit like... Uh, hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. Um, but I'm not gonna overthink it. I'm just gonna get into it and just hope, just, just, just see what happens. Um, but I'm really excited. Uh, I, it feels like it's just come around so quickly. Like, when we get, when it got announced that it was coming back, I was like, holy shit, that's so close. And now it's actually here. And it's like, holy shit, that was really close. Um, but anyway, let's, let's just get into it because I am so excited. I can currently only record one episode because I'm actually going out today. Um, and the one day I have a life had to be today when there's three episodes at release. Um, but hopefully I can get this up as soon as I get back home and then I'll get the other two recorded and they'll be up within the next couple of days as well. Um, so yeah, let's get into episode one. Ah! Help him. He is expendable. As are you, Lieutenant. I miss Mayday, man. The former squad, they are in possession of... God, this season's gonna be so weird with our tech. They have to bring him back. He's not dead. I refuse. He's not dead. If I don't look, it didn't happen. The Empire's here. What did you do? <laughs> oh, I've missed this. I've missed this intro, man. It feels like a million years since we've had, like, Star Wars. <laughs> Bum 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 bum. Ah! bum 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 <laughs> I feel so good. Ah. Also, this better not be a sad episode because I need to go out and I'm I can't cry. Payday! Yeah, you might want to rethink that. The vessel crashed in sector four. Should I send a recovery team? He's gonna say no. Negative. If they're past the perimeter, then they're as good as dead. You're as good as dead. Torch, baby boy, free him, free my boy. Good morning, Omega. How are you feeling today? Like a prisoner. I want to leave. Prisoner? Omega, you are no such thing. That's debatable. It'll take time to adjust. I want to know her story. We have much to do. <gasps> Crosshair! I, I don't like that they didn't acknowledge each other. I mean, I get it, but it's sad. Now I need to take a blood sample from you. From me? Why? If you're a clone like me, how come I never saw you on Camino? Asking the real I've question. Elsewhere, until Dr. Hemlock took me under his wing. And elsewhere, but where? In me. Like Nala say, sees in you. I never knew that I had a sister. Or I'd be taking my blood sample right out of that. Dude, the commandos. Their helmets make me so happy. Thank you, Omega. What a calming voice. Omega. Your sample was taken. Mm-hmm. Emery said it 
was routine. What do you know? I mean, obviously she knows a lot, but... It's not like what we did on Kamino. Why did they bring me here? To ensure that I cooperate. The Empire seeks the reproduction of the genetic encode. But the experiments on the specimens have yet to yield the desired result. What specimens? You mean the clones? No, not the clone. How nice to see you reunited with your trusted assistant. I'm sure Omega's presence here will only strengthen your efforts. Shall we head to the vault? God, his face has come in and ruin every single day, doesn't it? Let's see to your remaining tasks. We need a redemption for Scorch. Like, surely that's gonna happen, right? Right. What in what in the hell is going on? Damn, that is secure. The fuck is behind there? I hope Omega releases them. <laughs> Let them be free. I know they'll probably eat people, but still. Oh, did she bring him? Oh, Omega. She brought him some chicky nuggies. It's always good to make allies, especially with animals. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Back on my droid bullshit again. Oh, stop. I don't want to see this. I don't want to see them hurting. to come earlier, but there are too many guards watching me. You shouldn't be down here at all. There is no we. And there is no escape. I've already tried. Every stronghold has a weak point. You trust too easily. Maybe you don't trust enough. She just sees the good in people. Or likes to think she does. Before you make things worse for both of us. There has to be a way out of here. I'll find it. And he should trust her. Because I trust her. <laughs> also, I hope that that gives him reassurance. Like, he probably thinks that after everything that happened, that Omega and the others would abandon him and, like, would distrust him and like Omega's still here helping and is willing to help so I hope that he sees that she loves him thoroughly no matter what he deserves to know he's loved I said I didn't want to cry. Damn, that is a long time jump. Oh, she's got her little hair and a little, a little ponytail. That's so cute. Um. She didn't even look at him this time. 
So if they're looking for midichlorian, like, and Nala say is getting rid of Omega's blood every time, does that mean that Omega might... Oh, Bibi! K9 needs one! But hurry! If her wounds do not heal, the subject will be terminated. Then do something to help her! Uh, I am not a medical droid. It is not part of my. Then role. get a medical droid! Now look. I need to clean the wound for it to get better. It'll only hurt for a second, so put those teeth away and behave. Aww. See? What is your primary objective? Escape? Then stop wasting time on lost causes. Forget the hound, forget me, and complete the mission. Not without you. If I get the chance to escape, I wouldn't think twice about leaving you behind. Oh, crosshair. You're lying. You wouldn't do that. You're my brother. I'm not them. Don't risk anything for me. I belong in here. Might as well tell that dead brick wall. <laughs> I kind of like the markings on the wall because it, it gives us an idea of how, of how long it's actually been. What's going on? Surprise inspection. Standard procedure. Clear. Please don't take her little toy off her. No! Bring it here. Personal items are forbidden. I'll dispose of it. Don't! Please, Emery. It is for your own good. But it's, she's a kid! Uh, we have work to do. <sighs> Works so hard. The Emperor should be pleased we accomplished a successful transfer. Not when the M count was severely diminished in the process. If we do not match or exceed the specimen's original count, it is a failure. If the Emperor is as understanding as I am. Yeah, she knows. She knows that Omega has a really high midichlorian count, for sure. For sure. Look at you. You're almost at 100%. If you do not read the standing orders for the day, LH-201 has been slated for termination. No! What? Why? She's healed. It is protocol. Let go. Oops, it was an accident. My finger slipped. Badass. I mean, I would keep that way. I mean, actually, no, because you'd get in serious trouble. <laughs> Never mind. Now you need to run away I love that he's called Batcher. Okay? But I'll find you. Oh, I love him. I love him. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, I love him. Breaking the rules, I see. Fuck. Releasing a weak lurker hound into the wild, and your domestication of LH201 only made her vulnerable. You don't know she won't survive. Emotion and sentiment had no place within these walls. You would do well to remember that. Or what? Doctor, perhaps I should return oh! Omega to her room. Oh! Slay Queen! I know. You brought me here to make Nala say cooperate. She won't work for you if you hurt me. Oh. <laughs> of course, I'm not gonna hurt you, Omega. 
Your friend in the detention block, however, may not be as fortunate. Don't hurt Crosshair. He didn't do anything. I did have plans for CT-9904 despite his resistance to re-education, but I am willing to make a few sacrifices if your misbehavior continues. Actions always have consequences, sometimes not in the ways we imagine. Take her back to her room and restrict her access. Ugh, come on, Emery. There has to be something that you can do. You're not a very nice sister. She brought the doll back. The least she could do, but... Please don't let me watch him die. I can't, I can't, I don't. Oh! Honey! You know what? I feel like he's gonna be like a... He could be a big help in her escape, honestly. I feel like if the bad bats show up on this place, he's gonna like lead them to where they're supposed to be. Or he's gonna do something. He has to have a part in this, for sure. Like, come on. Oh, it's so good to be back, but also it's making my anxiety high as fuck. Like, ugh. I'm so glad. Like, I love that she called him Batcher, um, because he's he's one of the he's one of the squad. No, he's a bad Batcher. Um, well, he's a good Batcher. He's a good boy. Um, but that was really cute. Um, and trust Omega to get close to an animal. Like, I feel like if I was to relate to any character in Star Wars, <laughs> it could be Omega. Honestly, I'm not as brave and as strong as her. Uh, but like, she's relatable. Um, but that was a really nice first episode. It was nice to have just an episode on Omega, uh, and, like, her current situation, and, like, sort of give us an estimate of how long it's been with, like, her scribbles on the wall and stuff like that. Um, I... Someone needs to get rid of Hemlock immediately. Um, it was, it was nice to see Crosshair again. Nice to see Scorch again. Um, he will get his redemption. You heard it here first, he will. Um... And I am intrigued to see where we go in the next episode, uh, whether we'll be back with Omega still or whether we'll be seeing the uh, Bad Batch themselves. Um, I have no idea, but this is a good first episode. It really sort of gets you in the feel of things of like how Omega is doing, which isn't very good. Um, but... Ugh. Hopefully it gets resolved. Um, well, yeah, I'm very intrigued by the whole blood thing. Like, I don't understand, obviously, what they're doing. Because, like, they're taking their blood, then they're putting more things into the blood. Um, obviously, that's going to their subject that they're testing on um, to try and replicate the amount of, uh, like, the, the amount of the M count and stuff in there. Um, which I, again, like I said, I assume that Omega has a very high, uh, a very high midichlorian count, which is interesting because a lot of people were curious, like, is she going to be a force user? Like, is she force sensitive? And there was a couple of hints, I feel like, along the first couple of seasons um, where it was, like, possible. Um, but honestly, I, I feel like, obviously, she hasn't really unlocked that yet, but... I feel like that could be why. I feel like Nalise knows more than she's letting on, obviously, because she's, you know, not wanting to be there. But I'm intrigued. Uh, I'm I'm excited to get more information. Um, and yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next video. So peace and may the force be with you.